Hello, uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to produce reports using NED3. Uh, so you can start out by opening the file that you saved last time as a .NED3 file, and that'll bring everything up to date as you have saved it. Uh, so once that's in, you can go down and click on Analysis, Reports, and then select the 2017 Inventory. And from there, select the tab, select Batch Reports. And for this project, the tables that are going to be most useful are the timber tables underneath vegetation tables. If you scroll all the way to the bottom, you'll see that timber tables appear again underneath Removal Reports. Uh, but again, for this project, the one underneath vegetation tables are going to be most useful for us. So you can double click underneath the Inventory column and a pop-up will appear for your stand timber report. Now since for this project we've only taken overstory observations, I'm going to click on the select all overstory and then I'm going to click OK. And from there you'll see that below the timber tables uh, another row has appeared with all of those overstory observation uh, settings that you could have selected. And so I'm going to double click uh, now on that row underneath inventory and be sure that a number appears in this box uh, because as you start selecting additional tables uh, for different variables you'll notice that uh, more numbers will appear and those numbers represent what order these reports will appear in your final report. Uh, so next you can go and click on the output batch reports tab on the right side click on browse and this is where you're going to save uh, the file as a .html. So report, I'm going to call this one 2. Go ahead and save, and then generate reports will light up. And you can click on that. And once your report is produced, you can go ahead and scroll down, and you can see there's composition, diameters, Structure, relative stand density, volumes, values, biomass, uh, for all of your different uh, tree species that you had entered. So I hope this video was helpful, and again, thanks for watching.